everything revolves and is based upon the Akeda. The Akeda was the most difficult test of Avram Avinu. And when he finally saw Har Maria, where the Akeda was going to take place, he said to Eliezer and Yishmo, who had accompanied them, Vani Vanar Nilchad Ko. That's what he said to them. Myself and the Nar and the lad we're going to go at Ko. So Kosovarhu is to allude to the schus of the Akedah. So meaning the reason why we have the capacity and the merit and the ability to be worthy of Hashem's Brocha is because of the schus of the Akedah. I just want to elucidate this. The Akedah we find, Sultan in his worst way, tried to stop it. As it says in Chazan the Medrash, what did we go to Tashlech on Rosh Hashanah? Because when Avram was going to the Akedah, the Sultan came as a raging river, and Avram Avinu was drowning. And he says to Hashem, I'm drowning, I want to do your will. You're not allowing me to do, do your will. When he said that, the river disappeared. Because Sultan understood that if Avram Avinu withstands this test, whatever he will attempt to prosecute Klal Yisrael, this chos, this merit will silence him. Whatever brocha comes upon Klal Yisrael, there's always an attempt by Sultan to prevent the brocha from coming about. There's always a kitruk. Give an example. We're about to go into Eretz Yisrael. This is the second year of the desert. What happens? Second year. There's an incident with the Miraglim. We're about to go in. And because of the Miraglim, we wander for 39 years in the desert. We're about to go in after 40 years. What happens? The story with Bilam, with the Balpur. The Jews themselves, they fail with Balpur. Whenever a monumental moment is going to happen, there's always a Kitruk. There's always, certain always, as we say, Sotan Mishacharayim. Sud always gets involved. Like yesterday, I had said, we had the technical problems. So my sister Sutton, Sutton understanding the vow, certain values and certain moments, which are monumental, he tries to interfere. Birchus Kohan is so essential and crucial for the survival and the success of Klal Yisrael. He always attempts, they're not worthy. There's always a prosecution, there's a kitruk. We start Kosovo Chesbede Yisrael. Ko alludes to the Akedah. Ani vanar nelcho at ko. That's the reason why the Birchaz Kohan, the, the Mitzvah, begins with ko for that reason. Because in that schus, Sutton can't in any way interfere with the Brocha. That's how powerful and overwhelming the Brocha is. We find, which we mentioned, that the three species of the animals which have brought us Carbonos, Sharkes Veski Voled, the ox, the sheep, and the goat. So the Medjur says each one of those species is Beschus of Avram Yitzchak and Yaakov. Because we find when Avram Avinu hosted the angels, it says he took Egel. He took three calves and he offered them to the guests. The Akeda was the was the Ayul, that's the Kesev. The goat, the two goats, when Yaakovina went to receive the brochos, his mother said to him, go to the flock and take Shnei take two goats. So therefore, the three species which qualify, the only species which qualifies Korbanos, which bring about Kapora, atonement, each one of them is the schos of Avram Yitzchak and Yaakov. Again, what is Korban? Korban is Korban Lashem, the Smidus Arachmim. We're only worthy of Midas Rachmim only if there's no Kitruk, if there's no prosecution. If there's prosecution, that's Midas Adin, that's the attribute of justice. So what quells, what silences the Midas Adin? The Shorkes of the A's, because each one alludes to the Schus of Avrom, the Schus of Yitzchok, the Schus of Yaakov. Every day, Tfilah, when we when mispalel, we say, Eloke Avrom, Eloke Yitzchok, Eloke Yaakov. The Tfilah. Don't concept of tefillah is, is rachmim. 
If there's no Rahm Chas Sholem, it falls on deaf ears because we're not worthy. So we begin, Elokiavim, Elkitz, Yaakov again. Everything starts with Schusovos. That's where it begins. So the Bichas Kohanim begins with Koamar, begins with Ekedah. That's where it begins.